These are stripping you from death. I can take it off if you'd like me to, so you can see. This is not how the world normally sees Miss Delaware, but Kayla Martell bravely removed her crown and wig to reveal that she is bald. And I'm happy with it. I'm, I love the way I look without my hair on. These early photos show that she had a full head of blonde hair, but when Kayla was 10 years old, she began to lose it. You know, I thought the worst. I thought, am I dying? I was too afraid to even acknowledge it in words. At first, she tried to hide it, even from her family, but soon there was no hiding. Kayla was bald, diagnosed with alopecia areata, a rare disorder which causes unexplained hair loss. It started coming out in clumps, and I noticed a lot of hair on my pillow when I would wake up in the morning. Kayla's dreams of someday becoming a beauty queen were gone. So I wasn't sure if I should keep on competing. I almost gave up, and I had a moment of doubt and insecurity. But soon she began embracing being bald. She started competing in pageants, wig-free, and last month, beyond anyone's expectations, she was crowned Miss Delaware. When they called my name, I just remember thanking God. I literally just kept on saying to myself, thank you, Lord, thank you so much, because it was just one of those things where I worked so hard and it just felt so good. Now at 22, 12 years after she was first diagnosed, Kayla proudly posing without her wig in this week's People magazine on Stands Today. And she even appeared on CBS's The Early Show to inspire children suffering from the same disorder. Because of people and girls like Liliana, I knew that I had to be on the Miss America stage and I had to get there at some point. Her sights are now set on the Miss America pageant in January. This has been a blessing. I oftentimes say that and people kind of cringe, but I think my hair loss was a blessing uh, in a strange, strange way because it's given me a voice and it's given me an opportunity to really show people the message that they don't understand and that's that everyone is beautiful in their own way. And if you don't think you're beautiful, then nobody else will. And the Insider is already hard at work on Monday's show. Here are the stories you won't want to miss then. Jake versus Vienna. What really happened during their TV face-off? Then Kate Gosselin before her.